Football season is finally here. Catch my first team preview with head coach Scott Palti of the LCC Thunderbirds. It's going great. I mean, this is a uh, you know, football coach's dream here. First day of two days and getting out and getting the kids working hard and getting ready for season. This is such a special time during the year where you're evaluating your players, seeing who's rising and what areas need work. How do you go about that? You know, we have our, you know, we just have our system, our coaches, we have our drills. Uh, you know, we have a lot of guys back this year who played last year, so we expect them to set the example for our new guys, our young guys coming in, and of what we expect of them, what we need them to do each and every day at practice. And uh, we've got a really good group of kids, and they work hard, and it's a lot of fun when you got a, when you got a good group to work with each day. How do you build on the chemistry from last season? You know, I think our guys, you know, they each year I think they felt they got a little better. Um, the last two years we've made the second round of the playoffs and lost. And I think, you know, when you get to those points in the year and you play good football teams, I think you go into the offseason, your guys realize, hey, we got to get a little better in this area, a little stronger, faster, quicker. And I think that motivates them um, offseason, the preseason, you know, to go out and work hard and hopefully get over that hump and have another good year like the last couple. What are your thoughts on this year's senior class? Oh, they're a great group of kids. They uh, they really work hard. They do a great job of setting an example. There's eight of them, and uh, it, it's just a, a great group of young men. They they set the example at practice at, of working hard and uh, practicing hard, and you know just a real good group of kids that provide some really good leadership for us. What are your first day uh, kind of interpretations of this team, and how do you think they're going to be like? I know it's early. Yeah, you know, we're out here, and it's, it's a grind. You know, it's it's it, you're out here, just your helmets on the first couple of days. I think the kids, you know, it's not you're not hitting. You know, there's no contact. It gets a little, uh, little uh, monotonous, I think. But our kids are working hard. We're trying to you know, clean up the mental things, the little things that we don't have to hopefully go back to when we start going full go and running at full speed. And our guys have done a good job of that. They're out here practicing hard and focusing. You know, trying to eliminate the mental mistakes so when we get really rolling here that they'll be they'll be good to go. What was something, you know, your returning players learned from last year that they'll take into this season? I think they just, you know, to keep working hard and getting better and I think they know the level of how good you have to be to uh, to compete in the playoffs and be successful and uh, you know, I think they've seen that a lot of them have played the last two years and I, I think they know that they we gotta get better each week. We got a tough schedule starting with week one and uh, our guys know we got to come out ready to play and work hard each week, and it's it's a grind. We're not in a, we're not in a league. We're an independent team. We play a lot of good football teams. So I think our guys are standing. We'll get better each week, and hopefully that can get us into Week 11. What matchups stand out to you this season? You know, they're, they're all big. I mean, we're not, we actually being an independent school. It's kind of like they're all playoff games, all ten of them. You know, they're all important to us, and uh, you know we're excited for each and every one of them. It's it's fun. Our guys like chance to play football, and there's a lot of good teams on our schedule from week one through 10. So we, we, I don't, I don't know if there's any one particular one that stands out. Our guys are excited about all of them. Awesome coach. Thank you so much. And stay tuned all August long for more team previews here on the West Ohio Sports Net.